Hi Aquarius, welcome to Loveful Tarot. My name is David and today we're going to be doing a general reading for those of you who are looking for any guidance and messages in your life. We're going to be doing a Moonology Oracle deck card first, then we're going to draw nine cards from the Jumbo Rider Weight deck, plus one card at the bottom of the deck for advice. Guys, always a chill vibe here with me. Thanks for joining me today. I'm going to shuffle a little bit just so you know there's no shady business going on. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. I'll have new videos updated soon, okay? All right, let's see what's coming up for you. What messages do we have for you? Okay, Aquarius, what is going on? Let's figure out what your message is for today, okay? So, we have here, what do you need to release? Waning moon. Some of you have issues of releasing something. Some of you have negativity in your lives. Some of you need to let go of an individual, okay? All right, let's see what is going on for you. We're going to do a little bit more of a shuffle here, guys, to see what's going on for you, Aquarius. What do we need to know for you? I'm going to shuffle a little bit more, and we're going to begin soon, okay? These cards are a little bit tricky to shuffle because they are jumbo, but I do love them so much, guys. Uh, they're always a pleasure to do a reading with, okay? All right, so Aquarius, what do we need to know for you? What do we need to know? Okay, so we're going to draw one card first. Three cards for your past, guys. Let's begin. We have the Queen of Swords. Next card. We have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. All right. And lastly, we have the Nine of Wands. Okay. So, the Queen of Swords energy can definitely be your energy, Aquarius. Okay. Could also be another air sign, but I see this more as you. We have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. So, you could be dealing with someone who's an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This could be either a boss, family member, or someone you're dealing with, okay? This person can be unpleasant to you. You maybe had to um, give them some sort of uh, command or order, or you've told them something and they weren't listening to you. They could have been jealous. They could have been uh, some sort of uh, almost sabotage for you. You feel like you've either had to cut them out or you've had to really give them you know, your two cents, okay? And the Queen of Pentacles, yes, somebody here is causing you some sort of upset. Some of you can be dealing with someone who's difficult here, someone who's not very caring, someone who's selfish and who thinks about themselves, okay? We have here the Nine of Wands. So you can feel in this energy very defensive about it. You feel like you've put in a lot of work wherever it is that you're do dealing with right now. And this can mean that you now have to watch out for yourself and make sure that whatever it is that you're do de dealing with with this person, they don't end up causing you more uh, pain, okay? This definitely feels like you've either had to make a decision to uh, cut this person out or you're or you've already done it, or they have now um, basically taken a, a seat back and you haven't been in contact with this individual. If this is someone at your work, this could mean that for some of you, you've been avoiding them as much as possible and you're doing yourself, okay? And you know you're very intelligent. You can figure things out that this person was either mistreating you or manipulating you and you're now being very defensive and uh, you have your guard up with this individual for sure and you're watching your back, okay? So let's figure out what is in your present energy, okay, Aquarius? What is coming up for you? Or right now? We have the Three of Swords. Heartbreak. What is going on? Then we have the Nine of Pentacles, okay? And lastly, we have the King of Swords in reverse. So what is it you need to release? Well, right now you're upset about something. There's something causing you pain. You could be having issues with your relationship or your partner. You could be really sad about something. Perhaps there is a loss of some sort and you're dealing with it. Okay, 
but this is fine this is something that you're going through right now and it's okay you may be upset about it right now but things uh in terms of financial stability you're doing okay with your job and your career okay but whatever it is you're still upset about it and it could have been uh another air sign that was causing this issue for you so this could be another uh aquarius or gemini or libra okay this person can be controlling and commanding in certain ways could be a boss that you're dealing with that's uh, causing you some issues here maybe you need to leave for another job maybe there's someone around you in your uh either relationship or your family that's causing you some sort of upset they could be forcing their opinions on you they can be trying to make you do something that you don't want to do but i feel like you know better for yourself and you have the ability to shut this person out if necessary okay there is that heartbreak here so some of you can be dealing with a breakup some of you can be dealing with a loss of your job some of you can be taking on a new career and maybe you're going through some sort of upsets okay there could be some losses here and this is something that you may find difficult for you to uh, get over some of you can be going through a betrayal right now too this person could have betrayed you this air sign here or this individual here it doesn't have to be an air sign someone may have betrayed you someone may have told you a lie someone definitely has other intentions okay what if they're after your money what is it do they want what you have what is it what is it about okay Aquarius let's take a look at your future energy and see what's coming up for you your next card is going to be the seven of Pentacles in reverse then we have the Queen of Wands in reverse. Three Queens. Wow. Okay. And lastly, we have the Page of Swords. Okay. So coming up for you, I do see that you're going to be making some sort of impulsive decisions. Some of you may no longer be uh, saving anymore. Some of you can be dipping into your investments or your stocks or... You may be um, working on trying to get money out of something. Some of you may feel like there is no uh, energy anymore to put into a certain individual or situation. Some of you can be looking to buy a home and not having enough money or funds to do so, okay? There is a Queen of Wands here energy, which can be a fire sign as well. So Leo Sagittarius Aries. And the Page of Swords can be represented by air, but definitely could be your energy for sure. So the Queen of Wands in reverse, you can be stuck in this situation here. There could be someone also, a different person, negative, that's creating some sort of imbalance in your life, okay? You may feel like they are being dishonest or dishonorable about something, and it doesn't uh, work with you the way that this person thinks. So again, this can be either a coworker, or someone in your family who's causing these issues. This could be someone who's telling you that you need to save your money, but you're going to have to take out funds for some other reason to make some sort of purchase for sure. Something in that matter. You could be delaying certain things. You could be delaying a trip. You can be delaying on um, taking action towards something else. That's also important to you, but money is definitely something that you're going to have to focus on for this rest of the month okay then we have the page of swords so there's a new idea coming towards you there's a new hobby or a new uh, class or some sort of uh, thing that you're doing that you're going to be excited about that's going to bring new um, uh, perspective for you you're going to be challenged by this it's not going to be easy but you're going to be rewarded by it okay so definitely what I would think you would need to release here is the negative individuals surrounding you. So this negative, this reverse King of Swords and this reverse King Queen of Wands could be people or friends around you who are telling you to do the opposite, but you know what to do and you are going to be doing what you want anyway, okay, with the Page of Swords here. Let's take a look at the uh, advice card for you at the bottom of the deck. What do we have for you, Aquarius? We have the Tower card. Whoa, look at that. Okay. So, a lot of you are going to be going through a transition soon. Sorry, there's a police sign. We'll let that go by for a second. We live on a busy street here, okay? 
The tower definitely can mean that you need to prepare for some sort of major upheaval in your life. You're going to have to release individuals that are bringing you down and bringing you negativity. Perhaps you share different political views and different values. And sometimes we have friends that are with us for a lifetime and the others are just here for just the period in our lives, okay? So what it means to when you need to release someone, these are people and things that are holding you back from being your true self. And as you get older, you're going to realize that these are things that you need to no longer put your energy into, okay? And that may, may be a big decision to let go of these people or these decisions. And for a lot of people on the outside, it's going to seem like you're making some sort of rash decisions, but you're doing it for yourself, okay? And the tower can be a shocking moment here where you come to this realization that this is what you have to do. And you may be a little bit, um, you may feel some discomfort with this decision, but overall it's going to work out in your favor in the long run, okay? So don't forget to um, know that the tower energy is coming and that you have to respect that energy when it comes, uh, specifically based on the decisions that you make and whatever changes that happen, if they're really major and they cause a lot of um, change for you, know that it's going to work out for the best. All right, Aquarius, remember this, there'll be other readings coming up for you soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Thanks for being here tonight. I really appreciate it. And bye for now.